Hey everyone, it's Ivy, and today I am finally playing the Walking Dead series. This was highly recommended to me after the Wolf Among Us series I did because you guys love that so much and you love this game so much, so I'm really excited to get playing. Little disclaimer, I have never seen a single episode of The Walking Dead. Sue me but it's it's kind of like Grey's Anatomy where I'm like, it, I'm so far behind where it's like, I would have to dedicate like a whole year of my life just straight watching it. There's so many episodes. So that's why it's taken me a bit to play this game because I was like, I've never seen an episode. Am I even gonna understand it? And everybody was like, who cares? Like play it because this story in itself is amazing and it doesn't matter basically. So I trust what you guys say and I'm really excited to get playing. Let's go. All right, so we're just starting with this one. The Walking Dead, how it all started. As the world ends, Lee Everett looks for redemption and fights to protect the young Clementine. And just like the Wolf Among Us series, this is going to be a longer video. I'm going to do episode by episode. So we're doing episode one today. So just sit back, relax, and let's get on to episode one, A New Day. Well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Okay. Uh, use the mouse wheel or... Okay. Why do you say that? You know what they... Oh, we got the timer. Okay. You know what they say about reckoning? Does not really matter? Why do you say that? Oh, why do you say why that? Why do you say that? You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the... I didn't do it. Mm, and what do you and say? What do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. Okay. Oh, we're getting right into it. I thought it was going to be a longer cutscene. And the target at the rear mirror. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Making Ben? Making, making boy. Uh, so you're, you're from, from making Ben? Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case. Like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. With all due respect. A real shame, that is. Oh? Hell, the whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Mm hmm Good. Okay, look at radio, look at... Can we keep talking? I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? Uh, touchy subject. You wanna know how I see it? Uh, got much choice? I got much choice. Sure don't. <laughs> I'm just trying to joke. Oh. Okay, Regardless, he didn't take to my joke. Could be you just married the wrong woman. Mm, could be I did. I'm not gonna say fuck you, man. I'm already in the back of a cop car. I'm driving Don't want to see it much worse. He, he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses. And he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're sitting. I'm like, when are you gonna notice that? And then before long, he starts <laughs> kicking the back of the seat like, like does a not fussy care. baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's gotta stop. But that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. So maybe he was. So did he do so it? Did he do it? They caught the fucker red-handed, stabbing his wife, cutting her up as the boys came through the door. Well, he sits in my car, screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him. I think he actually believed it himself. Crazy mofo. It goes to show, people will up and go mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. 
This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious. Okay, I don't really want to talk. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. I waited too long. Oh, shit. I was distracted by the guy. I didn't even see the text at the bottom. I don't think it would have made a difference, though. The zombies. Uh oh. Oh, he's eating the cop's brain right now. As we speak. As I speak. But I'm alive? Broken leg, probably. Thirsty. Ah, fuck my leg. Ouch. Yep, brain's gone. All right, let's find a way out of the car. Okay. Uh, shotgun. Did he have his gun out? Oof. This way, window. Uh. Go again. Okay. Uh. Oh, again. I need to drag myself oh. out that window. Okay. Forward key, W. Shimmy, shimmy. Look at the door, use the mouse wheel to select an option. Uh, hand. Pull myself out. Oh, graceful. Graceful landing. Ouchie. Okay, you got the the keys to the handcuffs because I can't really do much with my hands tied. Let's go. Let's go. I already know you're dead. I just need the keys really quick, please. No, this way? What are you doing? Weird. That was weird. I was pressing the W key and he was not going forward. Alright, let's look at him. God damn. God damn. We go even forward, like more. Keys, thank you. Thank you for wait, how are you dead? You didn't get your brains eaten, I guess. Shit. Really? Oh, he's a zombie. He's gonna be a zombie soon. Hopefully he remembers me though. He remembers the awesome conversations that he had with me and I didn't really talk back much. Uh, officer. Damn, is that fast? Uh, uh, holy shit! Uh, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going. I'm going. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Get away from me! Shotgun, shotgun, shotgun. Shotgun, shotgun, shotgun right here. Oh, come on. Come on. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Shoot this mofo. Don't make me do this. I'm doing it. I don't care. Oh. God, the mouse sensitivity is really high. I gotta turn that down. <laughs> Got him, though. Headshot. Boom. Man. Well, <laughs> serious figure. Oh, Clementine. Help! Someone! There's been a shooting! That's what you say? There's been a shooting? Uh-oh. 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 Ah! Ouchie. Ouchie. Run, run, run. Okay, you just keep fumbling, sir. Run. Bubble. Yikes. Go. Crawl. <laughs> Leap. Please. Keep going, man. You're doing great. Oh my god, it's loud. That is so loud. Uh, 
Uh oh. Hello? Wasting all the bullets. Or nice distraction, I guess. Okay. Hello? Anybody? I'm in somebody's nice backyard. Uh, oh. Where am I supposed to? Oh, there we go. I wonder if anybody's home. Hopefully be real humans and not a zombie. I'm going to look around here really quick. Hold on. What is this? A tea set? Oh, is this Clementine's house? I'd fill one of those teacups with some bourbon if I could. Oh, yeah. Stole the pain. No matter. I'm not getting up there anyway. No. This leg the way it is. Help! Oh. Was that me that said that? It was a weirdly timed help. Okay. Let's go inside. This is probably Clementine's house, right? But she was like kind of the opposite way. Or no, no, she was straightforward. I don't know. I'm just gonna shut I up. Wonder if Let's anybody's go inside. home. I wonder if anybody's home. Can I? Can I not just go? Oh, I have to. Oh, I'm used to the Wolf Among Us where it's like you look and then oh, it's different. Okay, I see. Okay, I gotta scroll down and then use the hand. Go ahead. Hello, anybody home? I need a little help. Uh, let's open it. Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Please. Ah. Oh, the adrenaline's wearing off. Not an intruder, or one of them. The eerily house. Might need more help than I do. That's kind of fucked. <laughs> We're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. But oh. I feel like you can't really judge somebody's house when you're in the middle of a zombie apocalypse. But okay. What's that? Phone? No? Nowhere near me? Let's just check all the stuff over here. Get some water. I'm thirsty. Thirst quenched. Anything in there? A knife? Okay, let's go check the beeping really quick. Because I don't think it's in the kitchen. I think it's... This? Yeah, phone. Maybe there's something on there. Uh, go there. Three new messages. Message one, left at 5.43 p.m. This is totally not illegal. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Clementine! Okay. Message two, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, oh. I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Message That's not good. Left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. Oh, God. We love you. We love you. Oh. So sad. Daddy? Oh. Who? Why am I back in the kitchen? Oh, a radio.
radio. Who's your daddy? Hello? You need to be quiet. Who's this? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. You're not my daddy. No. Sorry. I'm not. What's that noise? I hear creaking. Where, Where are, your parents? are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Uh, where, where are, you? are you? I'm outside in my tree house. They can't get in. That's Let me smart. in! See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Let me in. <laughs> oh! Oh, 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 oh! I forgot I had to do this. God, my luck is so bad. I'm so clumsy. Ah. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, come on, time. Help. Hurry up, hurry up. It's time. It's time. It's time to do something. Go, kick. Take the hammer. Smash. 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 Look away, Clementine. Don't look at this. Don't look at this. Don't look at this, man. There we go. I did it. Man. Hi there. Hey. What's up? I'm totally not a monster. Did you kill it? She's like, what the? Uh, yeah. Yes. Hey, I think she was a monster. Uh, I think so too. Yep. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. They're not going to. I not at all. think that might be a little while, you know? Or never. Oh. Look. I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What that okay? should we do now? Mm, let's look for help. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. I don't think it's actually safe at all. I've almost died twice now. Let's go. Actually, Stay three times. I should have looked. Through the house for a change of clothes, though, real quick. Okay. Go. Hobble fast. Lead the way, girl. This way. Oh my god, these, con these controls. Let's go. Oh man. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This oh. sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. No. <laughs> That's hilarious. Come on, Clementine, let's go. What's the matter? Should I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? Girl, we're coming back. Uh, I, I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's okay. A good idea. Okay. You got it, girl. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Does he really look like a zombie? Yeah. I thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chomp. Uh, excuse me. <laughs> Maybe me because oh, the, we we're looking help. for help. Are you trying I can't to get talk out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. 
I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. I'm Chet. Chet. We shouldn't be out in the open like this. How about you help us clear the way, and we'll take you and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... That's not, that's, that's irrelevant. Uh, I'm neighbor. a neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Can't Stand say just, for too long just, just some guy. Can't say that. What do you want to do? I... Your monster's coming up. We gotta go. Uh oh. Leave quick. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Go. Push it. Again, keep ho. Let's go. Smooth landing check. Were any of those guys neighbors too? No, they're uh, out of town. Family friends. It's already dark. Oh, this is a corn maze, really? Am I gonna feel safer here? <laughs> Middle of fucking nowhere. Hey, Sean, I'm gonna run on home. My mama's gonna be in a snit. No sweat, man. I'll catch you tomorrow night. It was nice to meet you both. You too, Chet. Snit. I've never heard that. <laughs> Thank God you're okay. I was worried it'd be bad here, too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Old Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Mm-hmm. You've brought a couple guests. Yep, hope you don't mind. Uh... Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad yeah, well, he could be a help to somebody. Butter him so up a little bit. just you and your daughter, then. Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? Yes. Okay, then. Uh oh. <laughs> well, looks like you hurt your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah, it's not doing so good. I can help you out. Sean, run on in and check on your sister. You take a seat up on the porch and I'll go see what I have. He's so valid for asking her that, though. Let's have a look. Yeah, this is swollen to hell. Could, Could be worse. worse. That's what it sounds like. Seems like things got awful bad in the cities. What did you say your name was? Uh, it's, uh it's I can trust him. Nice to meet you, Lee. I'm Herschel Green. I feel like I can trust him, right? How'd this happen? Um... I oh car accident car yeah accident. that so where were you headed before the car accident why does uh home, home. where's home why why is I he asking so many questions is he a sheriff you hit a guy one of those things you've been hearing about on the road who are you with the girl no nobody, nobody. is that so yeah it is. You said we. We, but like, Asked I'm not going to tell mine. you. We got another displaced family of three Police sleeping officer. in the barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I didn't catch your name, darling. Clem Clementine. Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know. I don't like the dad. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious 
shit hitting the fan. I don't think anyone knows how big it is yet. Your True. son's right. You're gonna want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. Lee, come yeah. on. I don't Tell like what the dad. saw out there, man. Hmm. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Lee and those folks in the barn can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. Thanks. But if your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. No, oh, right in front of the kid. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, Thanks. which way you think you're headed? Towards making, I suppose. All right, then. Weirdo. It's like, what was I going to tell him, a police officer? Then he would be like, you're a felon. So I just, I don't know. It smells like... Dookie. Shit. <gasps> I'm sorry. I shouldn't talk like that. I thought you would find swear. it funny. Come on. Kids love that. I missed my mom and dad. I bet, Clem. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. They put us in a barn together by ourselves. It's kind of weird. Kind of weird if you ask me. I love you, baby. Oh. Hey, get up. Mm. It's for you. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not our daddy. Not our dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're gonna no offense. There's a tractor and everything. Oh my god, he looks like the kid from Toy Story. <laughs> we better get going, or we won't hear the end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Duck. Duck? Yeah, nothing bothers him. Like water off a duck's back, you know? Oh, that's, that's kind of cute, though. Treat lately. No kidding. But frankly, I think it's because he's dumb as a bag of hammers. Dad! Oh. But he makes up for it with enthusiasm. The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Uh. I'll see what the. Let me see what she wants to do. Ah, gotta consult the missus. I understand, honey. Uh. Duck, this is Lee, and uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. That is a very pretty name. Thanks. Well, we should get to work. We've all seen what those things can do out there, so the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah? Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I yeah. will to it. I like Sean. I, can I don't keep like an his eye dad. I can your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. Okay, let's leave you with this lady. And this guy's all right, whatever his name, I forgot what his name is, but uh, he just, I don't know, he talks, <sighs> he says some weird shit. Okay. It's Let's not the, the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Be sure to check in with everyone you met so far. All right. Let's go talk to her then. Hey there, girls. Um. Back in a bit. Okay, Lee. I don't really want to talk to her. I want to talk to Clementine, hey. though. So, uh... I'm just trying to talk to Clementine. Corpses aren't walking around. I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. 
We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Yeah, that's... No, I used to. I was let go a little while back. Well, that's too bad. Well, I hear people always clamor back to college after a big disaster. People don't want to die ignorant, I guess. Uh. Back in a bit. Hmm. Okay, Lee. I just don't. Mm, I don't like the vibes of these people. I want to talk to Clementine. Nice time we'll catch you, Clementine. Yeah. That's it. Clementine, I want to ask you if you can go. No? Okay. What about this way? Let's go talk to them. Hey, duck. Smile and wave. No brains in that head. You had to it? I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. <laughs> Riveting, riveting conversation. Oh, let's talk to him. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that sure speed things up. Got you, brother. My dad doesn't know how bad it is. He no, seems he stupid. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. Well, was, was the he one of, one of the walkers? I don't even know. He was either attacking the guy or asking for help. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes, and pulled the trigger. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh, uh yeah, maybe a little bit. Uh, Sometimes yeah. it's kill or be kill. I'm not gonna tell my bash girl's brains in. I don't think I'd sleep good after that. I'm just glad we're getting this fence built. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thinks inviting people in is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How is your family? Um, I don't. Uh, my, my I'm just not gonna talk about my wife. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, let's. Oh, gonna. Do you uh, think this thing will keep them out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Cool. I like Sean. Later. Let's go back to Herschel and. Now I think we can help him out. We got truck talk to hey Oh there. Kenny? Kenny? How's your son doing? Oh, Good, I'm interested in help. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? What does that I supposed mean to mean? I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? See, that's what I'm talking about. It's like, well, what? He just, like, is weird. I think I'm okay. I've got it handled okay. Long as I keep her safe. Uh, he just says I'm weird shit. Right. With those things out there, maybe, sure, that's enough. But you gotta ask yourself if you're the type of guy who can do better than that if her parents don't show up. I'll keep that in mind. All right, so what's, what's your, your plan? Family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could. Hop on my boat, I guess. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting dolphin. and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. Okay. Uh. 
They're gonna talk to her too. Seems like those two are getting along. Back in a bit. Wait, okay. I saw somebody come out of the, the barn. Yeah, the barn. Let's go talk to this weirdo. Herschel. You this is Herschel. Know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today, I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. Oh, shut the fuck up. I'm not sure I follow. Shut up. I ain't dumb. I caught you in that lie last night about who you were with in that car. And honestly, I don't even want to know. How'd you get out of Atlanta? I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. This farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan having a place like this. Are we cool now? Like, what's going family, on? I guess so was I. Family's important. That's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to? Yeah. Yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? My parents are in Macon. Let's tell them about my, my parents. Brother. Well, I hope they're all right. Don't ask about my wife. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Um... I was being attacked yeah. when she came to my rescue. Hmm. Can We're I not cool now. Piece of advice. Sure. Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're going to have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're going to make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're going to Bruh, uh, Shut up. But at least you have the common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Oh. What the hell? What the hell? Go. I'll get my gun. What's happening? That sounds that sounds painful. Ah! Oh shit, the king. The king. Oh, kid, I'm sorry. I got to get the kid. Get the kid. Hit the fucking. Yeah, I meant to hit him first, but I accidentally I misclicked. I figured the kid first because please, the tractor's me, on him, dude. No! <gasps> no! Oh, the dad's gonna fucking hate me now. Oh, he's gonna hate me even more. Oh, he hates me so much now. Get out. Get the fuck out of here! I'm sorry. Sorry? Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. Uh, I just fucking saved. I thought I could help them both. You thought wrong. And now? I saved a fucking kid, bruh. Please, just go. Get out and never come back. I, okay, I figured since... The tractor was already on the guy. I would have to get the kid off of the tractor first, so might as well just go for the kid. Like, logic. You guys aren't even gonna say thank you? You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Let's go, let's go, let's go. We gotta go. I'm sorry, Sean, I really liked him, but logically, I had to get the kid off the tractor before I can move the tractor. Like, I feel like I'm big brain for that. Well, 
This is as far as we're going. Then it's far enough. I forgot, I probably have to be mentally prepared for everybody in this to die because I feel like that's how the actual show is. Everybody's just dying. You can't get attached to anybody. <laughs> hey there, you friendly? Trucks run out of gas. Nope. Fuck! Zombie. Oh my god, this kid better not fucking die after I- okay. Oh, let's go! Badass girl! Let's go! Let the women do the work. I love badass women. We can't take risks like this. And we can't just let people die, either. When I say that door stays shut no matter what, I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. They could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? Yeah, chill out, lady. Oh, chill the fuck out, lady. We're just people trying to avoid those things, just like you. Don't come in here and swear at me. I'll say whatever uh, I want if you start threatening these people. You'll have to excuse her. The hell he or anyone will. This is about survival. Do you guys not see what's happening? What is it? It's just a kid, I, man. I have to pee. Oh. I'd go out there again. Okay, just a second. <gasps> then just well, go. Well, no, I fucked They've up. They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. I don't give a flying fuck. We're oh. in a war zone. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Oh, I just sent they Clementine to her death, probably. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He's not. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body. We'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning Yikes. him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, Damn. It's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. Reason with, reason with him. Reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Oh, well, Everyone I meant, like, let's just talk out. it out. Nobody's doing anything. Let's shut talk it up, out. Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here, and none of this will fuck All right, I'm killing this guy the next chance I get. Right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? He's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. Yeah, I'm can somebody him. check him? Ooh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. Dad, we get it. It's a big deal. Let's reason with him. Your daughter. Never yeah. Never happened. She's not some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Wow. Fuck you and her. I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee. Yeah. There's someone in there. Uh oh. It's just locked. Keys behind the counter. Probably. Hey, I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking out for my daughter. No, you're just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's what if the kid is big? in luck. She'll find the bite. Watch. She won't. And if she does, the first thing then we'll do with is it. sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, once she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. She'll turn fast. And then uh... there'll be three. Then we deal with it then. Yeah, then we but deal right with it. now we're just freaking everybody out. Then get ready to deal with it because that boy is bitten. Not gonna happen. Go fucking There's. check him then. And we're tossing him out now. Hmm. Get him, Kenny. This guy out. Happily. Oh, Jesus. Oh, oh man. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, you oh, that fuck? What? 
keeps happening? Wait, why does he keep falling? Uh, okay. Yeah. How does he just keep falling out of nowhere? Like, stop falling. <laughs> Thank you, by you the way. Okay. Just great, thanks. Uh, guys. Uh oh. I'm so glad I chose to hit that guy. Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Uh, uh, yeah, drop dead. Who cares? What's wrong with him? What's wrong with him? It's his heart. My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the pharmacy since we got here. Please try to get in there. Behind the counter where the pills are. I don't really want to save him, though. I don't really care. Uh. We'll get in there somehow. Thank I don't you know. so much. Figure it out, then. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here. Out mm. towards the end of Peachtree. Maybe don't I'll go work by my yourself. Way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. You're insane. <laughs> well, it's gotta get done. Plus, I'm quick. And I know Macon. Local? Born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's mm. a walkie-talkie if you get in a tight spot. Hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. And you? What's your name? It's Lily. My dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you? You keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. Oh, who's this guy? You got it. <laughs> and I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when I he like needs Carly. it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot, and I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Yeah. Now get him those pills. Well, he's just kind of an asshole, so it's really hard for me to want to give him pills. Like, oh, let's take an energy bar though. Really quick, let me talk to Carly because she's awesome. Oh. I have to give it to her? Shouldn't I want it? I kind of want to eat it. I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't eat it? Oh, uh, yeah, she might, I suppose. Yeah, give it to her. I can take care of myself. Okay. Oh. I didn't even think about Clementine, to be honest. I, that's my sign I should not have kids. <laughs> I didn't think about giving it to her. Hey there. Hi. Can I get Can you anything? I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll Here. see about that. Energy bar. I have it in my hand right now. Well, sit tight. I have it in okay. my hand, and I want to give it to you. Okay, do I not have it anymore? Oh, food box. Looks like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Can I give you my bar? Oh, another one. There you go. It's not much, but here you go. Thank you. Of course. Oh, uh, look at me. The pills are in there. All right, let's find a way in there. Check out it's the ATM for some reason. Glad this place didn't get looted. Okay. Uh. <laughs> Okay, got to... Let's talk to them really quick, I guess. How's he doing? I'm not sure I got your name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just Calm doing the fuck down, earlier. bitch. Everyone was. 
Now his heart's acting up again, and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. I don't care. He was mean. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? The dead are up, walking around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Yeah, I'm Sounds gonna... Good. I'm gonna leave. This, I don't really like you very much. Alright, let's go in here. Alive inside? What's in here? I can't. I can't think about them in here. Can't think about them. What think about what? Your parents, probably. Oh, weapon. Grab that shit, Clementine. Oh, a cane. What's that? This is my dad's cane. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. What? Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this cane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever. How is his dad's cane he here? How to make it look cool. Like you had. My dad gave it to me. See, dads are smart like that. How's his dad's cane here? Was his dad a pharmacist? What the heck? We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. Okay. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Yes. Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. Let's ask her how she's doing. Be a how good father figure. Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. No, oh, she saw a okay. mistake. Here we go. Do you have kids? No. Nope. You don't have a family? Hmm. Let's... Let's not talk about that. Nah. Do you play sports? I play soccer, but I don't really like it. I'm not crazy about it either. All right, a little further. Let's Why go don't push. You want to talk about your family? Do they like hate you? Mm, girl, you need to calm down. Uh, I hope not. It's just complicated. No, not. It's just complicated. That's all. Why? Very PG response. It just is. But you love them, right? Yeah, of course. Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Uh. Yeah. Not a bad guy. I'm not a bad guy, okay? Things happen, and we didn't talk much after that. My parents don't talk to me when I get in trouble. I can relate. Damn. I hurt my finger. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. All right, first aid kit right over here. There's a band-aid in there, I bet. Oh, good. Uh, oh, I keep forgetting I have to just scroll down. Okay, let's give it to you really quick. Band-aid. Let's have a look at that finger. How? It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. What the band aid? No. Yes, please. Look at us bonding. We're so cool. Lee? 
Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? We'll go back. They'll, uh, track us down. Don't worry. Why would I tell her I don't okay. think they will come home? We should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Okay. Let's examine the rest of the room really quick. Uh, there's a photo. So this was my, like, where am I? Oh, I owned... The family owns the office. Okay. Coincidence. Crazy. All right, that's dramatic. Find anything? <laughs> His face. <laughs> uh, I'll tell you. I like you. This place might help us track down the keys to the office. I know who you are. Oh, you You're do. Lee Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who is sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. <laughs> I paid attention to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer, but I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Damn, I got Did doxed. Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? No. No, I've been sticking to first names for a reason. Bro, who cares? Like. They don't need to know. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. I'll just keep it to myself. Thank you. How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose, but you don't have many other options. Haha. <laughs> She's, she's got that quick wit. Um, so I killed a guy, I guess. I killed a senator, a state senator, because he was sleeping with my wife. So let's hope that there's a logical explanation or reasonable explanation. There's not really like logic that comes to murdering people, huh? I'm just saying, let's hope that there's a reasonable explanation. Maybe he was trying to kill me first. I don't know. But I still like Lee. I still think he's a good guy. I'm playing him, obviously, so. All right, let's Get look at this. For that thing in here someplace. I don't think we have to look at the TV. I don't really want to know what's going on. My pants came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was her. I wonder if it was my dad. <laughs> trying to be a hero. Her, at least. Yikes. Uh, let's open the drawer. Oh, the remote. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Are we trying to watch something? Trying to watch that the news, get even more de depressed? No? Okay. What was the point of all that? That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Oh, hand. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're gonna help Larry. All right, we need to get keys. And the keys are potentially back here. Wanna head back into the drugstore with me? Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh... Why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because oh, you he heard was that? one of the things trying to eat you? You heard that? Oh. It's complicated. It's complicated. Sometimes things happen or you do things and you can't explain them. I'm not lying. I'm not lying. Let's uh, head back to the others. Okay, there should be keys back in there, right? Hey there, uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Oh, really, Glenn? Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie, or whatever? This is Lee, what's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and, well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. 
I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped out at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn. We're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <laughs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds oh, I good. don't want Glenn to die. Please, I'm no Glenn die, no. Until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Let's go. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use a jog. All right. Rain check on the pills. Can If you can just die slower, that'd be greatly appreciated because I need to go save somebody else because you suck. All right, let's... I don't think we need to look anywhere, right? Let's freaking just get- wait, how do I get out of here? Get down! Get down! Looks like a jock. <laughs> He's a high school quarterback. Turn zombie. Damn! Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Glenn? Hey, Glenn. Right, that wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. No. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked, and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Well, Lucky she almost got killed, so yeah, let's, let's just go. leave. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal over a girl. We I'm can, either, though. With or without you. Think about if it was you. I would be able to handle my own, let's but whatever. Let's save Glenn's damsel in distress. All right. What am I doing? What is this? What is this? Oh, I'm surveying the area? Is that what it is? Okay. Okay, this is the plan. We don't know how hard it's gonna be to get her out of that room. Yeah, it's boarded up. So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Just always attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Okay, sick. I played GTA 5. I know that, like, that silent move where you're, like, sneaking up behind someone and you just kind of, you know? Okay, I got this. Speak. Speak for too long and you'll be sick. Okay. Okay. What are we doing? We're going back. We're peeking. We're peeking this way. We can hide by that RV. Okay, we hide by the RV. And keep our heads down. Okay, should we do it? Let's do it. Maybe. Oh man. She's uh oh. Something. Uh oh. So we got that Where one right to there. Next? Close. Uh, I don't know. We can probably make it over to the RV or down to the truck if we're quick and quiet about it. Okay, let's go then. Let's go. Oh, oh. Quietly move. Let's go. Ding 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 ding. Carly, did you make it? Carly? We're a little naked out here. Except for Carly's gun, and we can't use that much. Okay, let's speak this way. I'm not sure I can take them both out myself. Okay. If I had a weapon. Okay, maybe this way. Uh oh, let's. Oh yeah, there's two this way. Yeah, maybe we go back. Maybe we have to walk back. This is not good. Yeah, this is not good. We walk back and then we go this way. Okay, there's a truck. That pickup. They really want to get into that room. Okay, let's hide by this pickup. Let's go. Uh, shit happens. I like that. Uh, 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 there's one right there. Okay. I wonder if there's anything in the pickup. Let's look. Oh, the screwdriver. Let's go. Oh, we can't break it though. Quietly. Now we just have to get it quietly. Okay, we 
We can't punch it though. How do we how do we get it quietly? We can't punch it? I think my only option is to punch. Oh wait. There's two options. Open the door. No? What about again? Awesome. Okay, okay, how about how about I punch? This guy's distracted. Fucking fucking and then we just go. I don't know. Seems like punching is my only option. Let's go for it. Ow. Hey man. That was that a some attention. Be careful. That was a really silent punch. One more, maybe. Oh no? Okay. Well. I don't know what to do, Dane. Oh! That's about as far as I got when it came to supply gathering. I didn't see I that. Have an idea for it. I didn't see it. Take it. Maybe we put the death. pillow and then break That's it? Really break, the, break the window? Right? Let's try that. Extend the window. Use the pillow. What are you gonna do with that? I don't really know. Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools, or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Okay, maybe not. I was gonna like put the pillow and then like hit it. I don't know. Can I go smother this zombie? Let's go you smother him. Gun. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Smother him. Smother. Silent. That Silent gun. Sick. Let's go. <laughs> Got it. That I never saw that pillow. Dude, it took me so long. Okay. What's up? Now we got something in here. Please be a tool. Please be a tool to get into the car. Unlock the gear shift. Oh, let's go. <gasps> it's a spark thing. Spark plug. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. Okay. I don't think we should push the car. Okay. This guy? Go get this guy? I don't think we should push the car, right? That's so... How is that not so loud? Awesome. How is that quiet? <laughs> how is that... I was pushing a car. I mean, I guess. Maybe. I don't know. Alright. Now what are we doing? What's the spark plug for? Wait. Wait. Let me see the spark plug. Porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. What is that? <laughs> really? Really? <sighs> really? That works? Okay. Well, I'm not going to question that it anymore. Brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Okay, let's get it, guys. Let's go back to the RV, go get those guys. Right? Carly can get one, I can get the other. Let's go move. Tip-toe, tip-toe, tip-toe. Oh, wait, no, wait, I got the one guy, so we just need to get this guy. As big as the prime walker killer. I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. Okay, let's do that. I'll wait for him to get oh, closer. Oh, okay. Okay, wait. 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 Now! Wee, they're closing oh. in! I- I did it! I- 
I pressed it as soon as it went away. <laughs> I, just, I swear on my life, I pressed it as soon as I went away. Okay, it's fine. All right, let's try again. I'll do it a little this bit closer. This is the prime walker killer. I should be able to take those guys out when they come around the corner of the RV. Okay, do it a little bit closer. Two, three, four, and boom. Head. Yeah, not the chest. Let's go. Smack him. Lee, get him. Smack him. Smack him. Nice. Right through the brain. For sure. Nice. Oh, a sledgehammer. No, wait. An axe. That's not a sledgehammer. Sick. Dude, let's go. Your weapon go. Into that ice pick sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. Dude, where'd your That's weapon cool. go? Now we've got this. I love Flynn. These two are my favorite. I forgot about Sean already. No that should help. Alright. We sneaking? We sneaky sneaky? <laughs> Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Why aren't we using Carly's gun? Come on. We've got two more left. Just use the gun. Let's go sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, sneaky. Sneak attack. I'm so good. I'm so stealthy. Sneak attack. Sneaky, sneaky. Do not have peripheral vision, please. You do not have peripheral vision. Ready, boom. Let's go. Ready? Boom. Boom. Rad. Let's go. Hello. Don't make us break down your door. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go. Hello, guys. we're trying to save you. In a minute. If you open up, we can take you somewhere safer. We've got a group in town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, what is her problem? In. What is her problem? She just wants to stay in there and starve and die? Stop, just stop. I'm coming out. I don't like her already. Oh. Hurt. Oh God. I, I said stay away. We need to get oh, you help. she bit? It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? Oh yeah, I she's bit. I told you, I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be no, fine. No, she won't. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and and you come back and you kill anything you can find. You have a boyfriend? When? I don't want that. It's Glenn. That Christian. Please. Just leave me. Please go. Can we just kill her really quick? What if you turn and come after us? What if you turn and follow us back to our group? I know. That was why I was locked away. I can't let this happen to me. Should we just kill you? You have a gun. So do you want me to do can it? I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? No, I can do it for you. Give it to me? I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, we can do it for you, though. Satanic. Uh, we you can't, can't have a gun. you do that to yourself? Then do it for me. We need okay. to get going. We'll Can do it for you. Please. This is crazy. Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet. And I can be with my family, and it'll all be fine. Yeah. Shoot her, Carly. Back up, please. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, Whoa. Carly, shoot her. Ah! Fuck, Carly, just shoot her. Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss. Just relax now. Dude, just let her do it. You she wants to, to do it. This through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Right. It's all just. No, no, no. 
What is he thinking? Like, he's really thinking that she could help? Or she could be helped? Oh, come on, Glenn. Come on. Let's get out of here. That was the right thing to do. It was. Here they come! Get in! Everyone all right? Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and, well, yeah. A traumatized, but he's fine. I've got a few canes of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the farm. What were you guys doing while I was gone? You weren't going to go get the pills for him? Hello? I have to do everything around here? We just need to get Like, what the fuck? You guys are just chilling? We'll do our damnedest. I need a granola bar. Can I eat it? Eat. Inventory, eat. Do you want the granola bar? It's not much, but here. You sure? Yeah. You're under quite a bit of stress. Thanks. That's, uh, really sweet. Don't mention it. You're welcome. Um, okay, so I need to find some keys. There must be keys around here somewhere. Oh, there's a box. No, radio. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Uh... Power? Mm, nothing. Flip the radio over. No batteries. There are no batteries in this thing. What now? You know that there are no batteries in that thing. Yeah, of course. I mean, yeah. No. Yeah, you're I can stupid. Try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. Hello? Are you like a time traveler? Like you don't know what a like batteries are used for? Anyway, who are you? Seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not nah. suicidal yet. No, no, the gate up there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Mm. Uh, I'll be back. Not right now. I'll be back. Right. I need to check Let really me know quick. If you want to. Any cards? Oh, battery. How can I with those things out there? Got one battery. Newspaper clippings. What did it say? Photographs, I do I really want to look? Well. Okay. Um, how are you guys doing? I haven't talked to you the whole hey, time. Lee, maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who did get punched though. in the mouth. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. You're welcome. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. No kidding. How is she doing? Oh, I forgot about her. She's good, I think. She's a tough one right there. She's just a little girl, Ken. What were you saying, Lee? She spent days surviving on her own? That's right. Not just any little girl can do that. Yeah, she's special. Okay, let's... Lee, I don't want to really talk to you. Okay. Sure. Or what? Back on Herschel's farm. Yeah. We didn't even try to save him. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast, pretty though. Fast, I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we it. killed that boy. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things. I acted. We didn't make a choice to kill John. You think you do when you look back on it. But in a moment. When things are really out of control, you don't have any choice. I guess. Console? Try to let it go. See, I don't... What's this we talk? Because you sat around and you did nothing. I saved your son. I still haven't gotten a thank you from that, by the way. Uh. So, you know, blood's on your hands. 
and that's that okay i guess there's no i can't find another battery let's go outside with uh doug and hang out have a good time how are we doing good want to go have a look around outside sure maybe i can find another battery let's have a look around okay okay <laughs> Oh, God. That's a lot. Mm. They just eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Oh. Alright, what are we looking for? Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Uh, trapped? The one trapped over there. Better him than us, huh? Oh, that's his brother, isn't it? Oh, shit. What? Do you know that guy? Uh... He could be a drugstore employee. Yeah. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? Oh, yeah. You're saying he might have the pharmacy keys. Yeah, awkward. I know. Could be anybody, you know. And they start rotting and get all chewed up. And... Okay, can we not? Yeah. <laughs> That's so can you imagine? Look at the uniform though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. Oh, I mean I can tell see you. What I can, find. can I not just tell you? Like I'll, I'll just tell you, dude. Maybe not. Okay, I, I can't tell you. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Wait, don't I have the picture? Yeah, I have the picture. Can I give that to you? I can give did remote. You do anything with this? Yeah. I used to fiddle around with stuff like that when I was a kid, but there's not much to do with it now. Man, I miss my robots. You're a strange guy, Doug. I know. Oh! That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we can make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Oh, we're assuming that I'm just gonna go out there? Okay. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Maybe. Maybe the Burke. Maybe the TV remote. That I can point at the TV store and turn on all the TVs. Maybe. Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do. What's that? It's universal. I could yep. program it to work with those TVs across the street. Let's go. I just hope the power is still on. You can just do that. Yep, the code is one, two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. Let's try. Let's go, well smart. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? They're not even phased. They don't even want to... There we go. That got a few of them to take notice. And they don't care anymore. We gotta put it on like the Discovery Channel or something. Yeah, or like Fox News. Let's put it on Fox News. Uh. 
Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Oh, we gotta take the brick. brick. Then we gotta use the axe to get the brick. Right? It's probably not a smart idea. Yeah, awesome. I don't know why I did that. Now to distract those things. Okay, grab the brick. I can't reach that brick. Can you open? There we go. Grab the brick. The brick is right there. How can you not reach that? Okay, close. Close the door. Close the door. No, we don't close the door. We don't close the door. That guy's coming straight at us. We don't close the door. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we throw the brick at the TV store. Toss it. Nice. Go. Rawr, static. Such riveting television. Now's the time. Okay, let's go. Run. Run. Be careful. Or not. Keep Maybe. An eye out, will you? This is so brutal. So brutal. I cannot believe this. Your own brother. Hey, bud. This is sad. I don't know what happened to mom and dad, but I know if you were there. You would have died for them. So, yeah. I'm gonna assume that's what happened. Did you find them yet? Give me a second. <laughs> I'm saying my goodbyes. I'm sorry, man. I'm sorry I wasn't here. But knowing you were to take care of them a little bit, that helped. Aww. But I'm at peace. But I'm at peace. I thought you have to hit the brain. Yeah, I was like, you have to hit the brain. Let's do it again. Again. This is so brutal. Sorry, bruv. I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is so weird. <laughs> Why can't I just do it correctly? Come on. I would have only had to do that once if I just aimed for the brain. Let's examine. God. There we go. We really took the risk that the keys were going to be on him. Holy crap! Oh, go! Run! Go! Run! Come on, it's like 10 feet. Let's go. Close, and then, yeah, we don't have a lock, so. When I, I could have unlocked it just with the combination, you know, but I didn't. I destroyed the lock. Man, that was close. But we did it. It's all that matters. Sad. I've got the keys. Great. God, you're amazing. Let's get in there. All right. Finally, somebody's coming with me to do stuff. Let's go. Use the key. Let's go. Find your. Oh, oh. no. Shit. The alarm. Hurry. God, there's so many like loading screens. It just. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Who's this girl? Oh, God. 
We're so okay. dead. Come on, maybe time to go. I'm gonna get the truck pulled up round back. Do it fast. I gotta get my dad out of here. I don't plan on dilly dallying. Honey, take Duck into the office and barricade the living hell out of the door behind me. Glenn, when you hear me honking in the alley, start getting people out of here. You got it. Doug, Carly, and Lee, you guys make sure our defenses stay up till then. And Lee, I better take that axe in case I run into any of them on the way to my truck. Here you go. All right, that door's not locked anymore. Shit. You three, get on it. I'll get back as fast as I can. Stay away from the windows. Uh-oh, let's go. What am I doing? Hey, Lee. If you don't make it through this, you should know that it's... You're a great guy. Oh, thank you. We will make it through this. And we will. If we don't make it through Imagine this. I told him to shut up. <laughs> I should know what? Huh? You said I should know. Shit. Oh, oh, Doug, my. Doug, Are Doug. Sure? Shit. Oh, shit. Doug. Okay, then. Come in time. Can you look for something to stick in between the handles? Something real strong, okay? Okay. The cane. The king. Clementine, did you find anything? Nothing. What? The window is screwed. Go. The king. Come on, Q, 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 Q. I found something. God, just put salt in the wound. Oh, I'm saving Carly for sure. If I have to choose. Doug's like cool and all, but like. I'm saving Carly. I have to. She's like so good. She's great. I'm sorry, but Let's like she's go. a good shot. She's a great shot. You got done. She's strong. <gasps> Clementine! 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 Go again! Do it again! Run! Son of a bitch! Yeah. I'm not letting somebody else get eaten today. Thank you, especially Kenny. a good friend. Fuck that Larry guy. Fuck him. After I went through all of that trouble. What a douchebag! I'm killing him the first fucking chance I get. Fuck Larry. Larry, literally fuck you. Where are hey, you? Go ahead. I think I need to go. What do you mean? Do it like. Yeah, I got friends there. And I just can't stay here knowing that they could be trapped in that city. Glenn, Sounds come like on. nobody knows what's happening here. When we left a few days ago, could have gone either way. I gotta take my chances. Can you just look over I'm gonna miss you. Oh, 
not like we'd have much to begin with. Uh oh. I do what you gotta, you gotta do. do what you gotta do. And I gotta do this. I respect that. You guys be safe. We'll try. Hi, Glenn. I would have saved you. If, if that makes you feel better. Where's Larry? I want to go kick his ass. I'm sure if I told everybody, yeah, I see you. I, oh, I see you. I'm, I'm, mm, where are you, bitch? Where are you? Hey, kid. Close call back there. Oh. Thanks for picking. Yeah, me guess up. what? Cause Larry no we have pushed to take me. Care of each other. Yeah, we do. Hey, about Clementine. Yeah. Earlier, I said there's some stuff out there that might screw up a precious little girl like her. You did. Well, I still think that's true. But after what I saw today, I think between you taking care of her and her taking care of herself, you two are gonna be just fine. Thanks, Kitty. You got it. Thank you for saving my life. Also, did you see Larry push me and leave me to die? Yeah, I'm gonna go kick his ass now. Wait, first I'm gonna go talk to Carly. How you doing, Carly? I'm okay. You know, considering. I do, yeah. I can't stop thinking about Doug. We couldn't have saved him, could we? I don't think so. It was either you or Doug, dude. Fast. I know, it's stupid. We just met. And he was such a... It's just that... I think that I liked him. Oh. Well, I'm sure he liked you, too. <laughs> you better have. Anyway, I'd rather be alone, I think. Okay. I understand. Okay, Wait, I thought they were, like, together, together. This is better. What is it? How did you choose? We both needed you. You picked me. Honestly, your shot is amazing. I didn't. I didn't. Ah. Sometimes we don't make choices. We just do what we do. I just wish we both could have made it, you know? Me too, Carly. I meant that isn't like a, I didn't like just choose you, like I just felt it, you know what I mean? You know, I didn't mean it as a, uh. anyway, you guys doing fine? Oh man, check this out, the Dumatron had this minigun on his shoulder, it's all like pow pow pow, I thought Super Dinosaur was toast, but you know what? He was He's such a better oh, man than me. Hey, Doc, uh, you wanna cool it for a minute? Okay, sorry. I'm sorry, there's uh, not a lot of kids here. No, it's not that. It's... I got grabbed again. I was there, though. I fell, and my walkie-talkie broke. Glenn had the other one. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Thanks. I know I need to be tough. I'm just sad. I know it doesn't make any sense, but it's how I used to talk to my mom and dad. Mm. And now they're gone. It's gone. Maybe we can find you another one. I'll just keep this one, I guess. Lee, come here for a second. No. Let me go deal with this. Oh, man. Clementine, another thing. What do you want? You like my daughter? Her dad tried to kill me. Yeah, so. Well, he did that because he knows that Lee Everett is a convicted murderer. And so will everyone else if you go near her. You hear me? I know who you are. And I don't give a shit about what happens to you. But if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, you watch your ass. Hey. I'm not even going to say anything. My dad would be dead if it weren't for you. Yeah, tell him that. That guy Doug is dead because of me. You can't be like that. You're only one man. I don't know. 
We're lucky to have you. I hope that's the sound of us winning this thing. Yeah, Kenny. Me too. This motor end's pretty damn defendable. We block off the entrances with some cars, keep someone on watch. We could stay here until the military rolls through. When are they going to come agree here? with that plan. Me too. We got beds, we got water, and most importantly, we got light. They're worse places to call home. Yeah, you're right. You know, guys, I think it's going to be okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Jinxed it! I thought we'd be fine if we survived the walkers. Never expected they'd starve us out. I want you to have this, okay? In case you or Clementine starts feeling weak. You don't owe me anything, Carly. How you doing, Clementine? I'm really hungry, Lee. We gotta get food, Lee. Soon. Howdy, I'm Andrew St. John. We're from the St. John Dairy. It's beautiful. I never did thank you for saving Duck from the Walkers back at Herschel's farm. Something's coming, Lee. There's gonna be a war. The Walkers don't worry me as much as the bandits. You fucked with us! Now we're gonna take what we want! There's too many of them! Ah! Right, let's look at the stats because you guys wanted me to review my stats back in uh, The Wolf Among Us, and I did, but I didn't include it in the video, so I'll include this one. Honesty lied to Herschel. You and 54% of players were honest. I was, yeah, I was honest. He hated me because I lied, I guess, but whatever. Um, who would you save, Duck or Sean? 52% chose Duck. Damn, that's like really close. This is really split. Holy shit. The loyalty side with Kenny, you and 54% of players defended Kenny. Who the fuck didn't? Like, that's so obvious. Gave Irene the gun, you and 53% of players refused to give her the gun. I knew she would die anyway, so I was like, meh. I honestly wanted Carly to kill her, so that's why. And who would you save, Doug or Carly? You and 49... 49%... Carly's... Who chose Doug? I'm sorry. I think Carly, like, I think she's going to be a lot more of an impactful character. I don't know. That's my opinion. Sorry, Doug, you were cool. But like, that surprises me that it's so split. Oh my gosh. All right, that's it for episode one. So far, I'm really loving it. I think Lee, obviously I'm playing him. I think he's awesome. And I don't think he's a bad guy. I don't think that whatever happened back in the past with his girlfriend. I want to find out more about that, but I don't think it is what it is we'll see i like kenny i think he's cool now i fucking hate larry fuck that guy his daughter she was cool until i saw the preview for the second episode so i don't know i think something's gonna happen with her i love carly she's one of my favorites and i loved glenn but he's gone so those are my opinions on people let me know what you guys think if it's like similar to the series or not i'm still not gonna go watch the series but let me know if your opinions are the same as mine or if they differ and why and of course let me know if i missed anything especially if something is really significant because of the tv show and yeah i hope you guys had a really fun time sitting back relaxing and playing this game with me don't forget to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you in the next episode bye